What's up, everybody? Oh my god, that was so funny. That was good. I, I like to... your intro. That's just like a little bit of it because I'm working on it, and I just like took a raw thing and threw that on real quick. But it's way better than that. You did a good job. I've been working on it. Um, Angie B, change of plans. <laughs> yeah, we changed plans midstream. Whoops. Midstream. Yeah. Oh, my whole picture don't show. I guess enough of it shows. You don't yeah, watch what I. You don't watch what I do, anyways. Who? <laughs> you. What you, are you talking about? You're. I'm. You're. You're the pupil that has the desk right up next to mine. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? No, I'm just. Joking. Oh my god. Remember back so, in school. You're so close to. Oh yeah, I'm copying off you. I'm so but, close to what? Um, a thousand subs. Someone said. Um, where did I put my sharpener? So I don't even know if these are dogs, but they look like dogs to me. They kind look of. like it. Yeah, they really do. Um, <laughs> we'll I, have to see if I'll you be can right make back. Them I gotta like get that. my sharpener. Your sharpener? How are you guys Roberta. doing? Some, how you Roberta guys doing? Roberta needs her sharpener. Who do we got? We got a bunch of people up in here right now, don't we? I got to get set up too. I'm running late. I've been, you guys, I've been working so hard on like putting together an intro and um, making it cool. And that was just like a little bit of it. Not the dog part. That was just for fun. <laughs> but the video part, let me know what you guys think. Um, Squids made it in time for a live today. Yay. We're all here, aren't we? I was supposed to do, uh, that's what I forgot to turn on. This I'm working on my own music too, but for today we're going to have to listen to this uh, yucky stuff, I guess. Taxi Lexi looking ass is here. Which one's the best? On what? Out of these, these five you get to pick from. <laughs> five what? What are you talking about? Music background. Music. Oh. Oh, I guess um, there's you eight. Can, you can probably play whatever you want because you're not monetized. So. Oh yeah. Well, I don't have the capability. So. I do. Do you? I'm gonna shut mine off and you can play something. Well, don't background. do it yet. Just leave it. I kind of like your chill music, but it gets old. I know. Is it loud enough? I, I got it. Um, it's perfect. It's perfect volume right now. Okay. Smoke. What's good? What's head. what's a good it's playlist for drawing? Dogs. It depends. Oh, dogs. I don't know. Dog music. Ask your dogs what they like. No. <laughs> 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 I'm I'm clipping that right there. <laughs> You oh, gotta I watch know. out. That was a good sarcastic one too. <laughs> From who? Me I'm, or? Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't done me yet. <laughs> you, I'm surprised you don't have one in me. What a, a clip yet? Yeah, a soundbite of me. Mm, I'm waiting for the right time. Are you? I'll bet. <laughs> well, um, let's see. Okay, I got that open. So I heard today that Def Leppard is kicking off a humongo. 2022 tour bigger than it's ever been that's good it's about Isn't that time. cool yeah okay so all right hold up hold up if i share my screen but don't your, your screen's gotta be your camera, i know right what so you could... what are you talking about me yeah. You got to point your camera at your dogs. Well, I know, but I thought and you were And then gonna... you got to have the music. No, I am. I am. But I just what? shared my screen. See how you can add it? Go ahead and add it. I don't see it. It's down at the bottom where you add someone. Heather's bratty yeah. looking ass is in no, the No, because I'm not on a computer. I'm on a phone and all it says is, oh, right there. I see it. I got it. Okay. Add to stream. Yeah, see what that does. 
All right, show me your face so I can make sure it's you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Roberta. Okay, so now can you see. can you make that one go away and just make it me and you or no? Um eh, never mind. Just let's listen to this music. I got to keep tracing. Cuz I don't think that's going to work. Yeah, I don't know how to do it. Wait, Potatoes' cat is named Cat Stevens? Or her dog's name is Cat Stevens? Her dog's name's Cat. <laughs> That's cool. I like Cat Stevens. My cat thinks he's a dog. Mine kind of acts like a dog, too. All right, I'm just... Oh, my God, I cannot... Hold on. I got to finish tracing. Okay. I'm trying to get all set up here, you guys. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> I freaking hate that. I may mean, do ya? <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> it, always, it always catches me off guard. I'm like, we just uh, weird. <laughs> I was oh. talking to Maligator on the phone the other day, and we were talking about something, she's like, weird. <laughs> and then I find myself saying... Don't you know or no? <laughs> yeah, you do. Or or no? Someone in la in my live the other day said, "Jay, are you from Wisconsin? You kind of have that accent." I was like, "Oh my god, no." I mean, I know it's close and stuff, but I think the Maligator accent rubbed off on me. Well, if you talk to somebody or hang around somebody long enough, then they, you pick up their some of their mannerisms. I know it's kind of weird. Weird. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to. Oh, there they go, right there. I gotta move uh, these. Why is there a big, huge semi truck going by? Okay, at I got seven o'clock at night. A semi. I don't know if it's. A, I just caught a glimpse of it. I don't know if it's a moving truck or what. Don't you know? I don't, can't even say it like that. I I know. Don't you know? It's very nasally. Don't you know? It's like a youper. How the youpers talk. Which dog are we going to draw first? We're going to draw... <sighs> well, you're right-handed, so I'll do it left-handed, so you're doing it right-handed, so my hand's not in the way, and I'll do it backwards. So You know you put the same dog on here. Tw this is the same dog. But that's no. pretty cool. Yeah, it is. No, it it's not. Yeah, it is. Oh, it is? Yeah, but it's okay because it's cool like that. I kind of like they, that. They were the okay. top two, though. And you said the first one's this one and the next three are that one. And oh, so maybe the first... it just looks like the other one. They look alike. I mean, one's just smaller. But okay, I am... Oh, wait. I yeah, no, have... they're different dogs. If you... Yeah. If you look at your two pictures you sent me where they got their tongues out, it's different dogs. Oh, the other one? I didn't know that... Bella the baby's on the left, right? And then the older one is on the right. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah. I like how she has her head turned. It looks it looks just like her. Laura Lou says, Bella, it's Summer. Summer Lou. Yeah, we're going to try to dry, draw these dogs. So who you else? Know what's, Go ahead. You know what's, what's weird? Hard, what's hard about these... Or oh, we gotta we gotta make them lighter and just do the eyes and the nose and the lip and the tongue and then we have to use your that soft stick charcoal the vine charcoal you have to go around mm. the edges okay. so it's gonna be a little different um so who here of course we all nickname our our animals right our, we give them nicknames we play off their names I, I know everybody pretty much does that but Who's got like numerous like nicknames for their dogs that don't even really relate to the dog's name? Like, for example, Summer has turned into because she's Summer Lou. Now it's Summer Roo because my gr <laughs> my granddaughter says Summer Roo. She can't say Lou, so mm -hmm. now it's Summer Roo. And then from Roo, now I call her Rhubarb. 
I call her Ruber. I used to call myself Soggy when I was little. Yourself? Yeah, because I couldn't say my name, so I'd say Soggy. What's your name? Scott. <laughs> so how is Scott even? Remotely, how, okay, but how does that even remotely close Scotty. to? Scotty. Scotty. Soggy. Oh, you were Scotty as a kid? Well, isn't everybody got a Y at the end when they're little? I don't know. Yeah, you know what the difference between the Southerners and the Northerners when it comes to names like that that have a Y at the end when you're a child? When you're in the South, that they don't get rid of that. Like, right. you are forever Billy, or Bobby, or Jimmy, yeah. or Scotty. Yeah. The forever. South does that. Yep. It don't matter how old you are. Well, yeah, I know a girl from the South. Her name's Sarah Sodi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Do not become a comedian. I had to say, I had to say that. <laughs> oh God. Okay, well, I'm glad you got it out of your system. Oh, no. <laughs> and now that that's out of your system, we won't be hearing that again, correct? No, we won't hear that ever. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that day, I got to say, though, that day, you must have been really tired or something because everything that you said and you were like, Yelling at yourself because you couldn't say nothing right. You said so much wrong. Like this what dude, words what are were you all talking about? the day I got Sarah Sodi from. Oh, I know. I was saying everything wrong. I was like Roberta that day. Okay, so say <laughs> hello were. to Bella and Summer. The oh, babies, there they go. The baby's on the right. <laughs> yeah, and what's weird is when you look at their faces, the baby looks younger face than the smaller one. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, Bella is on the on the left. She's more um she's very I don't know what I don't know what to say, like very narrow in the middle. Almost like shaped like a greyhound. Oh yeah. Oh hi Rach. Rachel's in the house. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> I may or may not know Miss Rachel. <laughs> Okay, so let me switch cameras here. Um, we're gonna try to go to. What's your camera two guy's name? John. My desk. John. Yeah, you said you yelled at your camera guy the other day. I think you called him John or something. John, what are you talking about? You forget everything. No, I don't. When you switch cameras, you're like, uh, John, camera guy number two. Oh, I did? I don't even remember yeah. half the stuff I even blabber. I think you called him John. I don't even know. <laughs> I don't remember half the stuff I blabber. <laughs> I love you too, Rach. Okay. All right. Well, I got to quit using jokes that are uh, more than an hour old then because. Yeah. I mean, I literally say things remember. and I have clueless. I, I don't even think when I'm saying them, to be honest. Okay. All right. I really don't want to turn the overhead light on, so if this is good enough, let me know. Yeah. You can't really see it, can you? Well, the angle's kind of hard, yeah. Well, I don't have a desk like you, you know? Oh, yeah. Mine's made. Well, kind of. It's well, like here, a glass I'll... computer desk, and I and it had a little piece of glass up on top. There, just proof. Oh my God, Heather! You got him, Heather. Smart ass, looking ass. Yeah, see. Oh yeah, it looks like a blank piece of paper. It looks good. <laughs> uh, no, you can. It. Yes, you can. Barely. I can see it on my screen. Well, that's all you need. If you can see it, then. Well, no, good. I was just showing everybody proof that I sketched. <laughs> you did. Okay. I will turn the overhead light on. Hang on. Look at Angie B. I want to be Jay's dog. I need a vacation. LOL. Lay in bed and just look out the window. I'm exhausted. I know. They like that. They, they're they content. Mm -hmm. All right. Bright light. And shadows now. So it is what it is. 
That's my mic. Okay, this is as good as it's gonna get right now. So let's begin. I'm ready when you are. You ready? I think so. Are you sure? Yep. Okay. Um, let's see. What are we is gonna what do? What a loose leaf. What are you talking about? What are they talking about? What's a loose leaf? Oh no, I just tore it out of a sketchbook. Yeah, it's a loose leaf, right? Isn't that what you call a piece of paper? Loose leaf out? paper, but I think she thought it was like a rig like a Oh yeah. It's out of a sketchbook. <laughs> Okay, we're not drawing this today. Yes, we are. I was joking. No. Oh I my god, I was gonna hang up. <laughs> You're gonna. Hang up. I was all prepared. I'm like, no way. Okay, let's do um, let's do the eyes and the nose and the lips. Okay, what first. pencil are we using first then? They're the darkest. Probably the. What do you got? A soft and a medium. Mm-hmm. Probably use the medium, so it's doesn't. And we'll do the left dog. So this dog has like a dark, it's super dark, just like right in here. And when it comes down, there's like a right, dark spot right here. You said you soft can, one? I'm sorry, I was reading. I don't know if Nikki Two Poles was being funny. I'm trying to figure it out. I can't keep up with chat. Yeah, me either. I'm bad with that. I'm just, you know, I'm glad that uh, I could fill in because uh, I'd probably just be like laying on the couch. You wanted to. You were all excited. You're I, like... Well, I've been wanting to like, <laughs> I, I was because I've been wanting to draw the dogs. I even told my kids, I'm like, I'm going to be drawing the dogs. Yeah, this will be cool, cause you'll be able to, you'll be able to frame it and hang it up, right? I don't know. I can't find my sharpener. This is a problem. The hair is gonna be a little difficult, but we'll figure it out. Scott Skulls, I have an issue. I don't have a sharpener. You don't? You have a okay. knife? <laughs> yeah. What happened to you? Oh, I wonder uh, if I can use this. Having your eyebrow sharpener. I don't or know. I mean, I your mascara. I can't find it. Okay, so while we're here, let's. <laughs> yes, Nikki says she's being funny. Um, we gotta do the nostrils too somehow. There's like a. I'm probably gonna get ahead of you. Go while ahead. While we're I'll... yeah, while we're here, while I'm thinking of it. We need some people who aren't afraid to come up on panel. You don't have to have your camera on, but to come up and just kind of um, commentate, chat for Scott on some of his lives when sometimes he interacts with you guys and sometimes he'll just do his thing. But on the ones that he wants to do his thing, is there anybody who would want to come up one night and just chit chat and kind of be the go between? Uh, Lucia, next time for sure. Or Audra, my bad. She said, I wish I was drawing with you guys. I'm having dinner with friends. Well, that's a good thing. Dinner with friends is a good thing. We hope you have fun. Okay. I improvised. You did? <sighs> Figured it out. I guess. These are really hard because I can't even see. I'm using, you can look at the picture if you want while you're drawing because it'll be easier for you. Because Not really because the horse, cause the horse really... was. The horse was just a generic, like, I just sketched it real fast from nothing. Okay, well, I don't, I'm going to have to, I'm following you. So. But these are, got to look Just let like me do nothing. Thing. Just let me do nothing. Oh, they're fighting, see? Tell them you're drawing them. I know. Stop it, I'm drawing. Stop. <laughs> 
So how Whatever. would we do like the outline? Out here? Like I mean, the whole like, outline of it, are we going to do it darker or lighter? No, we're not even going to touch the outline because we're going to take that vine charcoal after and oh. we're going to do all the way around it and darken that. So we're just it. accentuating some parts? Yeah, we're doing all the black, like their okay. nose, their eyes, their the lip, the okay, shadow cool. underneath the ear. There's not much on them and we'll figure hair out after. Because you can do it like really realistic, but it takes a long time because you got to like do each hair individually. Yeah, I don't need to be that precise. <laughs> Lucia says, my granddaughter tonight had me cracking up. She's two. Where does she come up with stuff? She says, I walked over to her and said, did you poop? She goes, can you smell it? <laughs> I laughed so hard. Huh. Uh. I'm raising my four-year-old grandbaby at 50. Her parents are going to be gone for a while. Oh, single mom of four. Bless yes. your heart. It's a good thing they have you. Yeah, this is really hard to do. Tony S. said to use a medium. For this Am stuff, yeah. Yeah, use the medium. For oh, the I was with. using the soft. Oh my god. Because it won't smear. Tony, won't why didn't I listen to you? It wouldn't. It won't smear as much. I'm sharpening this with like this weird, like, blade that I have. You got a blade? It's like an exacto. Well, no, it's not like an exacto. It's like they sell them. They they call them eyebrow razors. <clears throat> this is what they look like. Obviously, that has charcoal on it. No, but oh, I need one of those. I need my eyebrows raised. Raised? Isn't that what you said? It's an eyebrow razor. Yeah. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> raised. This is funny. Oh my You're God. funny. I laugh. My no, I'm funny. not. It really is hilarious. Is. <laughs> I like it. I cannot. <laughs> She's like, <You're>... what? <laughs> you are nuts. It's like cast aid on my horse. Remember, I cast an aid. Yeah, right. What? <laughs> Nothing. Never mind. Are you talking that was about last week. That was last week. Never mind. <laughs> you guys, I think he cracks himself up. <laughs> See? Oh, man. I need to make this. He's the only one laughing. Oh, Lucia said, ha, ha, ha. I don't know if that's a genuine <laughs> laugh, though. That might be like, <laughs> like mine. I probably. Ha. 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 Your pencil laughed. So, <laughs> so let's talk about our dogs. I got, well, so, the only, I got a, you got any dog stories? Oh, I got lots of dog stories. I grew up always having a dog. We had a dog when I was little. So everything was when dog, I was little. Oh, I know. I called myself Potty because I could say Scotty. See, you don't laugh at my jokes. <laughs> um, I did that on purpose. <laughs> Lexi says I was laughing at Jay. Thanks. <laughs> okay, so anyways, I got my first dog when I was four. And it wasn't really my dog. It was like the family dog, right? Right. And uh, my sister was in German class at the time. And she named her Shotzi, which is actually Shotzi. And the reason it was Shotzi was because that meant little sweetheart in German. So I had shot Shotzi until Shotzi got hit by a car when I was in like seventh, sixth or seventh grade. And Shotzi was like 13. And then my mom didn't get another dog. So I had to wait. And when I moved out, I went to the Humane Society. I was 18 and I went and I got Peanut. I adopted his little ass. Was Peanut a little dog? 
He was, yeah, he was like 17 pounds and he looked, he was black and he looked like a Pomeranian. He had like that tail that go that flips, but then he oh, yeah. had like the face. It looked like a mini Labrador, like head shape of the head. He was, a, he was the greatest dog ever. And I had him for 18 years. So like I got him when I was 18 and like I got married, had kids, my kids. It was like, you know, our family dog. And he's been like the best dog. Like he'll forever go down as the best dog. Yeah, I can see what he looks like as soon as he said peanut and then he said it's like a Pomeranian. Aw, Snow Angel. I got my first dog at four. She lived until I was 20. Isn't that crazy? Oh my gosh, these dogs are terrorists. Well, that's like that cat I had. So when I was little, we had a... We had a dog named Tonga. So what the kind top of dog of his, was it? Collie. Aww, so at the top of his, yeah, at the top of his nose, you're gonna wanna like make some go like this. And then, See, but you did the hardest part. I mean, it's really hard to screw this up completely. I know people think that, oh my gosh, I can't do it. But I mean, really, it's a, even if it's not perfect, it doesn't look like you screwed it up. You know, that's what I mean. I mean, mine is yeah. really more blurry. Yours is more fine lines, where mine is more like not so precise. But at any rate, the hardest part to me would be the actual tracing. Because you really, like, you were able to trace whatever, draw whatever, and make it look just like my dogs. Hey, Tracy. Oh, my gosh. Single mom of four had a German shepherd named Duke for 16 years. Duke. That's old for a German Shepherd, too. This ain't gonna work for Angie, that. you don't have to stop talking about grandkids. You can talk about whatever you want. That's why we're here. So this dog Tonga I had, he, uh... Then you want to take your eraser and kind of go like this right here, too. I don't know if it looks right on camera or not. <laughs> Why are you looking at mine? And it looks like I'm drawing something obscene. <laughs> <laughs> I just looked up. Yeah. You have a German Shepherd named Rowdy. That's cute. I'm not worried about it. I'm, I'm just going with the flow here. So, <clears throat> excuse me, this dog Tonga. We had a swim pool down in Florida like everybody does. I don't know if they still do, but we lived in a neighborhood. Like, everybody has a swim pool. Like, that's common down there. Like, all it the is. regular. Like Not the, everybody, you know, though. But well, yeah, like the common. middle, whatever it's, middle class is it's now. It's more but, common than it is up, up there, yeah. Yeah, and so. I'm going to go off camera for just a second because i got to do something. But go ahead, I'm here. So, we had a pool, and every time we'd go swimming this dog would run around and around and around the pool and back and forth mm -hmm. until its paws bled. Jesus. Like it would run back and forth on the cement. Yeah. I just remember that, but that was a pretty cool dog. From the heat? Or from... I, I, well, it was hot, yeah, but I think because the cement was rough, you know, and it, oh, yeah. it just like skid back and forth. Well, you like, know what's pace. crazy is my dog's... Don't, do not like the grass here. So, like, the grass here is so much more rough, you know? It's like that crab grass, because the grass we have in Michigan would just burn up down here. But, it ha like, some of the grass has these little burrs that grow off of it. They grow up, and they look like little tiny, little green 
fuzzy looking things and then they dry up and they become these little pointy ass like daggers and they're like literally the size of a pea if that and they hurt like hell so like if you step on one those little daggers get stuck in your foot oh my gosh why do you have the russian people here do you have a mod in here besides me i don't i think a couple can you guys it. delete hide that person the rxub bomb ngo and don't click on anything that people put in these chats like that because they're like viruses are they mm. well they're trying to get control of your um oh, yeah. computer so with your shader um without mm -hmm. even drawing on the tongue just take the shader that's got your charcoal already on it if you don't have charcoal on it then put go on your little scrap paper remember how i showed you you rub the charcoal on the scrap paper yep. and then you like yep and get some on it and then rub it a little bit and then come back on the tongue and just use your shader to and it's darker up here right by his lip Look at Angie B. She goes, yeah, I see the bot thing with the with the big eyes. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's stupid bots. <laughs> Creep town, dude. <laughs> There's a lot that I've thought of and I'm like, oh, I got to I got to download that and then I'll forget what it is. I need to start like making a little list because I'll forget. And then on the center of his tongue, kind of go like this and then just with the medium charcoal, I'm using hard, but just kind of put a little bit darker, right? Not black, though. Just kind of. Well, it's black, but kind of pressed lighter. Just put a little bit. I'm still shading, but yeah, keep going. I I like how you, how we go at this pace. It's perfect. You do. Where I'm ahead of you. Yeah. You're not too far ahead, but. He's got a little. Uh... So are they both, both boys, girls, your dogs, or is they're both girls? Here? They're both girls. Mm -hmm. Bunch of girls up in the house. Yes. Females unite. And then the end of his tongue has a little line too. Right yeah, some people were saying like, oh, you named your dog after Summer Wells or something. Like, no. Yeah, no. So I can't remember. Honestly, I, I got her from this um, breeder. And they had all the dogs named, and I was torn. I didn't know if I wanted a male or a female. And since they're Goberians, they're part, she's part husky. She's half husky and half golden retriever. And um, the boy, one of the boys, Rocky, was the only one that had one blue eye and one brown eye. And there was three people to pick ahead of us. And... Unfortunately, they chose Rocky. He was the first one picked. I knew he would be. But then the other boys were not, I don't know. They didn't have like, Summer has like that big, like, she has like that big wide, like golden retriever head, you know, just like yeah. a big dum dum. And the other ones had more like skinny faces. So I went with Summer and I think they only had one other female other than her and I liked her little stripe down her nose I didn't draw their eyeballs in for you it's all right I got this they're just, they're just Rosie like... has all boys in her house and 
Oh, your husky had one blue eye, one brown eye. That's so cute. Oh, yeah, we did have a husky, too. I remember now. Huskies are so pretty, but man, they are energetic and they are little shits. I can see the husky and summer come out she's very naughty but she's so smart but she is a naughty naughty dog sometimes <laughs> she, i swear she like deliberately goes after the things that are mine when she's yeah. like upset with me like if i if i'm outside doing stuff and i don't take her out with me and she's inside i'll literally hear her running up and down the the house and i'm like oh my god what is she doing right or she'll get into my stuff. Like she goes in the bathroom and she'll jump up on the counter and grab something of mine. She and knows, she knows what's yours. Like she I knows know. Yours. Mm, exactly. She does. It's funny. And then I tell her she's naughty and she's so dramatic. She'll like look at me and then drop to the floor. Like all dramatically and you hear her like thump to the floor and then she just looks at me and just lays there all frozen she's so weird <laughs> it looks really mine looks really dark on this on the screen but it probably isn't to you guys like the nose looks completely black on my screen but not in real life yeah I don't know so I'm not sure. What does it look yeah, like? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Can you see this? Um, Can a little bit. That? Is it like the eye look black or can you see how it's gray in there? No, the eye looks black. I mean, you can yeah. see a little bit. You can tell it's not. It's just the angle, the lighting. Yeah, it looks too dark on the screen compared to what I'm really doing it. My tongue looks funny. Like it's too perfect shaped. Why is it laughing at you? Oh my god. <laughs> I, used to, I used to say that. I cannot. I, I haven't said that all <laughs> Yeah, what, since you were like eight? <laughs> yeah. What a dork. I can't see your tongue. You got your camera. I know. I'm going to surprise everyone. You are? Mm hmm. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh wow oh she's got it there it goes she's got a sound bite from scotty skulls no this is gonna be your sound bite um i don't know if you can tell what that is can you, can you tell what that is <laughs> does that look too does oh it probably looks really dark on the screen i know i'm the one drawing and i'm asking everybody else what i know it looks right <laughs> I, I just like everybody else's opinion, you know. Uh huh. Like it, it might look okay to me, but it might well, you've be. managed to uh, draw without everybody's opinion, right? Yeah, most of the time. <laughs> it's funny when I draw something they don't even think it's what it is. It's so funny. <laughs> and it's like I didn't even see that. I drew a flag one time, a rip torn, tattered flag, and it was like. A year later and they was like that's a cool eagle in there and i'm like what <laughs> like i didn't even know and what was I, it there was a, a tattered flag blown in the wind like torn and faded oh and it looked like an eagle inside it and in where it was torn at the white part looks like a dang eagle and i didn't even mean to do it and everybody sees that in it and i'm like that's weird <laughs> weird <laughs> yeah See, sometimes things are just weird. See, one eye on this picture you can see really good, and the other one you can't. Did you see I made a short inviting people here tonight? You did. That's like professional. <laughs> I've it? never made a short before. <laughs> you haven't? No, because, no, I never have. I never really had a reason to. But now, YouTube, I just got a thing from like, 
their creator like monthly whenever they send like a newsletter and they're going to be doing more with shorts i guess potato said they like to draw and draw till their arms about gave out shorts are kind of cool i mean because they're you quick, could do you cool know? shorts with your drawings if i time lapse like yeah like a quick short yeah yeah a little teaser like this right here i could just film just like closer on the eye and just have it me going like this and then that's it then it ends see you soon Ange. she's got to get the munchkins toofs hey kim maple i saw you joined earlier i'm sorry i think we were talking about something what are you talking about this one has like two marks like that see how i did the eye whoops i put it in the wrong spot hold on don't look yet too late they're a little higher if you take your shader i got more than one but Take your shader, you can go. Choo, choo. Marks over his eye, her eye. Oh, I got in my hand. Can you switch the song? Yeah. You know what? How about yeah, if I just. It... Can I, like. I thought you was working on that part. I am right now. Does that look like your dog? Yeah, it looks it like does. a dog, but I don't know if it looks like. No, your it dog. does look like her. Does it? Mm-hmm. I guess I'm doing something right then. Oh, show. Let's see. Uh, shader. So in the ear. This music kind of like is a little bit too repetitive after a while. It starts to like put me in a trance. It's not long enough. Well, I think we're just, I think we're way too uh, quiet. It is Bailey. I think we're just like, if you're talking the whole time, it's different. But like when you're just sitting and like we're focusing, yeah, it's kind of. All right, let's see here. Maybe I should just put my phone on like. <laughs> Shuffle <laughs> would be interesting. My music library is like bipolar. Let's see what comes up. OK, here we go. I don't know if you'll be able to hear this, though. Yeah. You can hear it? Is it too loud? No. Oh, Heather wants to know where her wrench is. I can't give you a wrench on here. Yeah, no, that's too loud. Okay. <laughs> tell me how. <laughs> I mean, tell me. When it first started, it was good, and then it just went. How about now? Turn that other one off. I did. <laughs> you are crazy. I think that's funny. You probably can't even hear it now. Yeah, it's um, it sounds weird though because you have a your mic's really good, like in it cuts out background noise so when you try to play background noise it kind of um see what i'm doing oh, here i on can the... turn the threshold down oh yeah you got all kind of the volume could be a little lower too i guess oh my god anything else uh medium four by four i know that's not a truck Okay, how about now? A little or quieter. Yeah, that's good, I guess. 
I mean, is it cutting out still? It just sounds like it's underwater, kind of. Oh, okay. I don't know what is it. It's because of my mic. You're right. Oh, it's be can... Yeah, it's trying to cut it out. Yeah, I know. Like, it's. Yeah. Yeah, we're drawing doggies. How about now? It's loud. <laughs> it's really loud. Kinda. There you go, right there. But you can't hear it all. That's good, right there. Yep, you got I it. didn't even do anything. <laughs> oh, well, whatever happened. So here on the left, you see what I'm doing with my shader? Yeah. There's no, I'm not using my pencil at all. I'm using my shader, right? Mm -hmm. Now the eraser I'm looking for, I can't find. I got one shaped like a pencil, but if you take your gummy eraser and put it to a point, so it's pointed, you can, we'll do it again later, but I want you to, try it while it's like this and just you can go like this and you can put hairs coming out I don't know if you guys at home can see that or not Your, yours looks better than mine you're drawing it good mm -mm. I think so It's too loud? I think so. Oh it was God. good a minute. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is it like overpowering loud? It was, yeah. Okay, I'm going to turn it off. Just put the other thing back on. Because it's a pain. It's blasting in my ear anyways. How do you um play that and not have... It's... I just had it on my phone. No, I mean, but not have YouTube do... like not want you to have it well you're not monetized so it doesn't matter oh all right like well, when you're monetized it <clears throat> will um i got copyright claims on some of my time lapses because of old music i had on there yeah but... that just means that they make money off of it but like when if you're not monetized who cares but like when you are monetized you don't want other people to make money off your work so that's why you don't want to do that when you're monetized does it take money away from you or they just you just won't money? be able to monet you won't be able to run ads on it or they'll run ads on it and then the money's they the royalties go to the copyright owner so like if you played um Def Leppard it would the royalties from the video would go to whatever you know Sony music or whoever. right I see so later I gotta watch that well, the thing I wanted to ask you that I didn't understand was, okay, say we do this, this gets uploaded, right? Mm hmm And then later I get monetized. This, mm. this um, video right here will never, will never get view percentage or make or add money, right? Mm hmm It's only the ones after. You know, I don't know. So that's what I was asking, because then what somebody could do is you could you could um, somehow record this or whatever and edit it, right, and change it. Do oh, you can always re-upload it. it. Yeah, and re-put it on later. Yeah, because it's yours. Like, you don't have to worry about changing it because it's your it's your original video. Oh, so I you see. can do whatever you want with it. You could save it and re-upload it. You can... Um, you can do whatever you want. I just, I don't know. That's a good question. I don't know if you can go back and add. I don't remember how that works. But I do know that you can definitely re-upload. I don't know what this is here. But... I mean, you could re you could upload your um, videos like so many different ways, really. You could take one that's like a certain speed and then... Another one that's a certain speed, you know, 
Uh-huh. You can make them really fast, or you can make the same one in a different rendition, different music, different. I don't know. I mean, the sky's the limit, really. And then like you chop see chop one up and chop part of this and make a whole new video from it. And yeah, and then like see what people like watching the most. You can edit all videos. Checking says. Yeah, hey, checking convictions. The copy, free copyright tunes. Oh, you know what? If yeah, I there is a I... lot of music you can get. I have Epidemic Sound, but there's so many sites that you can. Can you guys hear that? It's very loud, yes. It's loud AF. How about now? Yeah, it's loud. It is. Mm hmm. Turn it down a little bit. How about now? There you go. But that's the only song I got. Oh, uh, just, yeah, turn it off. <laughs> well, we can listen We're to good. it once. <laughs> you can't go, one go around's all right. <laughs> oh, my God. This eye is, the dog's like, what? <laughs> right here, look at that eye. <laughs> she, but it's funny because she does get that crazy ass eye. And <laughs> she does eyes. that. She does that when she like she'll get like a burr up her ass and she'll mm-hmm. run around the house and she um like will jump from the recliner to the couch and like get the freaking rug all messed up and then she'll look at me and she'll have that crazy ass eye with that <laughs> tongue hanging out. <laughs> That's funny. No, I mean it's her. So you guys want to see mine so far? Yeah, you're supposed to be showing it. See, look, that looks good. Yeah. I don't like her left eye. It's a little too. You got the little thingy underneath like a dog has. How does that go? It goes. Yeah, like. Like the cartoon thing. Mm -hmm. Is that their lip that actually goes right up to it or is it? Still, yeah, it's kind of like, like it separates a little bit underneath their nose. But the, it's not open all the way up, right? It's kind of a weird little line they got. Wait, what are they talking about? What are zoomies? Those are mufflers that go in your car. Is that what they're calling when the dog runs like that, though? Zoomies? Because Potato and Bailey said it at the same time. Look at your really? convictions. She said, yes, it's loud AF. <laughs> <laughs> it was. <laughs> <coughs> oh, well. When your dog Sorry. runs around crazy, it's called a zoomie. I've never heard of that before. Zoomies. I just. Yeah, call you're, it. Good at, you're good at following me along. You, like, look what I'm doing, and then you just. Yeah, I kind of play off it. You give me, like, the the gist of what needs to be shaded and then I kind of just go with it. <clears throat> You're a natural. Not really. Just kind of winging it. And then right here on the edge of this ear without leave like a light spot like go back in a little bit. Checking conviction said that zoomies are new to her too. Thank you. Because Bailey and Potato were like zoomies. <laughs> Incognito yeah, potato. That. Incognito potato likes the twirl. So we got that spot there, kind of. Till her arm just about give out. There's this like is really line. relaxing. You guys should join in sometime. This kind of comes out right here by the eye like this, and then it kind of shoots off this way like this. It's like a little... Except Scott just does not want to do any true crime with me. Okay, put in one... Tomorrow we're going to kill it. Tomorrow? Yeah, what's going on tomorrow? We're going to kill it. It's a surprise for everybody. You know what we're doing tomorrow? You have an event on. What are you talking about? Oh, yeah. (laughs) <laughs> the you world already knows. <laughs> then what are you asking what we're doing for well, if I end up in on? Because I don't know if everybody saw the event. 
Okay, oh. I'll promote it. So okay, tomorrow, you're the promoter. Scott's going to be – no, I'm not the promoter, but I am right now. So tomorrow, Scott is going to be recreating Laundry's skull. I'm going to reconstruct it. Because everybody wants to see it. Potato, we already seen it. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna. Did they already have it out? No, they didn't release those. They would. They're not gonna release that, are they? Release what? That the reconstructed skull pictures Hell from the no. anthropologists. Mm -mm. They're not gonna do that. No, we're not seeing. They're all redacted. So right here, you're gonna like take your little point on your shader, just barely touch, and kind of do this. And we might have to go back and lighten them up, but we'll see later. You guys share that out um, wherever you think that uh, someone might be interested in seeing the laundry drawing. Yeah, or Roberta. Skull reconstruction tomorrow. Roberta. For real. A real life Roberta. Maybe we can get you to do another sketch of Brian's mother's and you can like tell us what her skull would look like and we can compare them and see if they're really twins. Just kidding. You know what I want to do though? I want to draw that, that, uh, you remember that lady that walked across the driveway of my house? The black dress lady? I think it was really a blue dress, but yeah. Devil in a blue dress, blue dress, blue dress, devil. And nobody in a blue knows dress. who she is. I want It's a draw. neighbor. Is it? Yeah, maybe you can uh, send her the photo after. There's a little. And she'll and right she'll here. call you and say, "Why are you so obsessed with me?" <laughs> Look at mine. Yes. Hi, Summer Lou. Summer Lou. Oh my god. They're gonna look at their they're gonna look at their drawings and like bark at them. <laughs> I know. Hers just said she likes it. Little shithead. Kind of easy doing? to draw her features when I look at her little butt every day. Yeah, like you know what they really look like, like real. Come here, Rue. Let me see your face. Come here. Oh my god. You got cute. We're getting there. Yeah. <gasps> That's one anyway. Oh my god, Angie says yes, Scott. Draw Bimbo in black dress strutting her shit in front of the house. <laughs> strutting her shit. I want to put her in the Angie. woods with like fog and dead trees and stuff. Angie. <laughs> That's so funny. Why uh, let's so see. Um, there's this other thing right here too. It's a little bigger. Whoops, I'm using the wrong pencil. And then we want to do. It's almost like eyelashes, but it ain't. It's really like the darkness around the eye, the hair, and the hair mixes in. So it. There's like a little line. Yeah, I'm no good at shading. We'll do this over here. Yeah, you are. Yours looks like better than mine. I Someone know. wants to know if he's gonna be holding the dry bag when you <laughs> when you draw. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, Scott's a little slow with people who are actually funny. I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever's oh Snow Angel, I apologize. <laughs> Scott's humor is a little a little different than the rest of ours. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it? Scott's Pretty much. Cool. Yeah. Oh, we're getting some definition in the eyes now. <clears throat> the 
it's starting to, and then take the medium one, the medium, go right, just like right in these creases, and make it like real dark. Ah, right uh, painting services by Steve. He said, no super chats, darn. Well, never no. miss an opportunity <laughs> to tell a girl how pretty she is. I'm waiting. <laughs> <laughs> waiting. Waiting. <laughs> This isn't right right here either. This line that comes down, it's got to be more. Um... Hey, Summer Lou, look here. Oh, you got me so cute. Hey, Sum Sums. Yeah, she's Sum Sums. Summer Lou. Summer Rhubarb. There, that's looking better. Why you so obsessed with me? Steve, like why are you so dog? obsessed with me? Does it look like a dog? No. We gotta... Not at all. We gotta do this under here, too. I think this I is fucked kinda mine up. Dang it. Dark. Like, I messed mine up. Oh. That's why we have erasers. It. You can fix it. Oh, yeah. Erasers. How do I make her snout? Oh, I see. I have to like go out with it like that. Right? Yeah. This kind of gets dark when it goes to the edge. Kinda. My God, my messenger is blowing up. Who is it? I think the edge of the tongue's got to be darker right here. Ukraine stuff. Yeah, right at the bottom of the lip. It's got to be. Yeah, to me, the detail's the hard part. And, like, it doesn't even look the same on the screen as my paper. Abs. It doesn't to, look the same. I need to, what I need to do is I need to um, take the good photograph. Summer's sitting I'm here finished. posing. I don't know if you'll be able to see her. She is. She's so laying you, here. I don't know if you'll be able to see her. Yeah. Summer. See her? Oh, She's yeah. sitting here looking at me, letting me draw her. Is that the one we're drawing? Oh, it does look like her too, don't it? My uh -huh. picture looks like her. Summer! Yes. And you can see where she would get the crazy eye. <laughs> yeah. She is a big girl, though. And then there's Nosy Bella. Good night, potato, potato. You say potato, I say potato. Let's call the whole thing off. My nose looks 3D and real. I guess, yeah, if you're on a smaller screen and you can see the detail, it probably... I'm trying. Like, I can draw a dog. Like, you know that crazy dog on the thumbnail? Yeah, that's hilarious. I didn't even look at a picture of a dog when I drew that. I just, like, whipped it out crazy. Like, really? that's the little ankle biter dog, right? The loud ankle biter one. Yeah, that, it cracks <laughs> the me little... up. Squids was in here earlier, and he said that dog reminds him of his own. Really? Mm. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Whoops. Do you know Squids? Yeah. He said he finally just caught a live today. Well, just... you guys, he, you guys, like, are what one of like ten males that actually like chat in the community. It's not a whole lot of males. Yeah. yeah. I'm gaining. I'm gaining males. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You will. I got to show tits to get a lot of male viewers. I'm just not oh, willing yeah. to do that. Just not my style, so. So you can take your shader and just kind of go around the outline. Scott just, like, he just, like, <laughs> skipped right over that. It's true, yeah. though. I just like it's true. If I were low, if I put makeup on and got all done up 
and put a low cut shirt on and went live. I'd have a bunch of guys here that didn't give a damn about true crime. They just want to be pervs. Well, that's like the news ladies. Man, them guys ain't tuning in to get the updates on the news. Oh, I know. They're just looking at the girl. Behind it's the gross. Cat. It's really, it's really icky. That shit grosses me out. But it's true. I mean, it's how society works. And that's works, why so. I don't. I just can't do that because I. It makes me uncomfortable to think that people are like gawking at me in that way. I don't know. Just ugh. not. My, it's just not my style. So this isn't really the dog. See the shade line around here? That's not the dog. That's going to be the background. So it looks funny right now. Um, but when we fill the rest of it in, it's going to look good. And then once we do that, the dog is going to look really light. And we're going to probably have to go back and like shade some in. I made this part, so I don't know what the coloring is like right here on the dog. Me. Sorry. Uh, if I'm not humming or singing, hey, Eve, I know it was horrible, wasn't it? Horrific. Those people, I don't know, man. I think COVID has really, 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 really changed our society. It's been really strange. Yeah, it's different now. Mm, yeah totally different and not just in a masking up or more virtual kind of way it just everybody I think acts different I think it changed us people like, are a lot people are a lot less courteous now yeah like in public than they used to be that's why like when someone came in here and said oh no I have to miss tonight I'm going out to dinner with my friends like dude go because not not Enough people are, you know, taking the time to do stuff like that anymore. It's become something we don't really do like we used to. I went, my brother came down and um, we went out to dinner. And literally we were going to go to a steakhouse. We got there and the girl's like, Oh, it's a 45 minute wait and we were starving. So we left and I'm like, let's just go to Cracker Barrel. Like that place you can always get a seat, you know, because yeah. it's so damn big. So we go to Cracker Barrel and literally half of the restaurant was empty and people were waiting. It, we still had to wait a half an hour because they are so short staffed yeah. that um they can only serve so many people and i'm like this freaking sucks man it's just not the same it's not the same society we lived in before and i just think a lot more people are spending more time online and yeah. i think that's making like that's for people that do bad things online that's a bad thing because they have you know obviously more time and there's more people and with that makes problems that are worse. If you get my my drift, if something you it's, know is it's gonna compound you know what, it. You know what I call it? Hmm. The devil's playground. Mm-hmm. For real. Yeah. See how I'm shading just out around it. We're gonna do like a whole thing back here, but then see how the dog pops out now. And see how right on the edge of the ear you leave it light. And then you can shade in, and that gives the definition. Yeah, I can't do all that. That looks really good, though. That gives the definition. But I don't even have the whiskers on yet, or I haven't done the hair yet. Okay, well, we're going to have to pick up the pace, because it's already been... It's 8.15. It is? Yeah. Okay, Are you? let me see your dog. I mean, I'm pretty quick. good. I can, like, finish off, like... So we need to Watch. go to the next dog. Yeah, let's start doing the other dog and then, because look, that's where I'm at. Okay. I'm pretty proud of my snout right now. Yeah. Like it's this looking... side of my snout. Mm hmm. Oh my God, it's so hot in here right now. Hang on, I got to go turn my ear down. I'll be right back. Okay. I'm going to talk to Chad. <gasps>
Shit. <laughs> Shh, you guys didn't hear that. Son of a gun. <laughs> All right, Summer Lou, stay there. We're going to knock over my mic. How many people in chat are drawing this too? I seen one person is. True crime finding answers. They look alike. Yeah, she's doing good. She didn't even know she could draw. They're crocheting. My mom does that. Okay. Crochets. Yeah. Is that the one with the hook needles or the straight ones? I think I so. Remember. Oh, I don't know. There's knitting and crocheting. I says, is it the one with the hook ones or the straight ones? She goes, I think so. <laughs> It's either one, whatever. Who said I, don't I know. think so? I didn't say you that. did. Yes, you did. <laughs> Just now, you did. <laughs> well, I didn't. I said, I said, there's knitting and crocheting, dum dum. Uh, oh, which one's which? There's one that has them little hooks, you know, on the on the needles, uh, and then there's Savannah, ones Savannah, Georgia. Straight. I hope you feel better. Knitting is the ones that have the hook on them that you could like kill someone with. Crocheting, okay. I think, is the straight needles, but I might be backwards on that because I'm definitely not either. My grandmother, here's a random fun fact. My grandmother was a seamstress, like, her whole life. She um, did it out of her home in Indiana. Like clothes? She would make clothes. She made wedding gowns. She made bears. Like, you know the bears that um, you can move their arms and legs and stuff? Oh, yeah. She made all my kids bears. She made me and all my siblings bears. And then the clothes that uh, they had on, like, she'd make them clothes that matched, like, our personalities or whatever. Oh, that's cool. Mm hmm And then she always put a little tag on the inside, and it said, made especially for you, and then it had her name in there on everything. All right, we're doing another dog. This one, yeah, the, pictures, go ahead and... the picture you sent me, the nose is, like, all black on the front. I can't really see it. Um, Sounds like a personal problem to me. Yeah. Well, I guess. Yeah, oh, the I can't crochet. Even... Yeah. Wait, what? Jay, you got it backwards. Savannah, Georgia, true crime. What? Wow, that's confusing. What is. Tell me what that means. Where at? Got... God, yours looks so much better than mine. Like, no, it doesn't. I did not use the fancy fonts. Crochet needles have hooks. Knitting's a straight one. Yeah, okay. So she crochets. She's got the little hooks on there. No, I'm talking about um, Savannah. She's talking about her name. Like, she said it's backwards or something. I'm just confused. Oh, the true crime finding answers one? Mm-hmm. Because I said, hey, Savannah, Georgia, or something. Oh, yeah, it could be Savannah, Georgia, 65, or Georgia, Savannah. I know. Right. It, like, tripped me out, yeah. Well, you got it farther than me. I couldn't even, I didn't even say the first part. I just said the last three words of it. I can't. I couldn't figure out what it was. The, this one, the older one, has sad eyes. Oh, the needles. 
I got confused because I said I, I I read where you said I do names in fancy fonts, and then <laughs> I'm just confused. I got your name right. <laughs> let's just forget. Let's just forget that even happened, okay? Yeah, I don't even know what's happening right Thanks. now. I think I just confused everybody, per usual. I think so. So we are doing it here. She wants me to pick up the pace. Can you keep up? <gasps> okay. Let's take a gander. Yeah. Summer that looks, Roo! That looks good. Look, it's you, Summer Roo. It's you. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Summer. It's you. Oh, my God. It's craziness. <laughs> what a dum dum. Bella. Look. It's you. Wow. <laughs> She's got so much personality. <laughs> She's crazy, though. Hey, involuntary polymoth. All right, now to start on Bella Rose. So, my dogs have middle names. Oh, they do. Mm-hmm. So it's Summer Lou and Bella Rose. Oh my God, that was so loud. <laughs> oh my God, wait, do wait. Let me be prepared. You should have seen Summer's face. She gave me that <laughs> dummy, dum dum look. She jumped down. Do it again. <laughs> There's Bella. Come up here, Summer. What is it? <laughs> She's looking for it. Come up here. Come on. Like, what where is, is that coming from? Do it again. <laughs> oh, I better not do that. She'll be chewing my damn headphones. Oh, She'll yeah. Think She'll think a it's squeaker. a squeaker. A squeaky toy. She just There'll tears everything. Everywhere. This thing here, it like has a thing in it that mo makes it vibrate and like go across the floor. Mm -hmm. And then it would make like barking noises. And uh, it doesn't work. It worked for maybe a week. And she swings that thing around and it's hard plastic. I know, <laughs> Angie B, she said, Jesus, that made my ass jump. <laughs> 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 it did me too. It's like, hello. I'm gonna mess this eye up. I can erase it. That looks, the eyes of this one look like a Labradoodle. This one? Mm hmm I don't even know if I'm going to draw the little nostrils because they're, I guess they're right in here somewhere like this. We'll just, dogs have the thing that goes like this kind of, don't it? It goes like this and it goes like this. Is that how it goes? Mm hmm Like that? Sure. It's like a pumpkin with a face. Oh, I woke somebody's dog up. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Whoopsie daisies. Sometimes I just go and do a bunch of dark. And, uh, Sounds so professional when I do that. Why am I so hungry tonight? <laughs> I don't know. I'd really love a pizza. Let's get pizza. Sounds good, man.
Well, I made buttered noodles and uh, a couple garlic sticks. And oh, yeah. I kind of burnt the garlic sticks, so I was very disappointed. Chihuahua and bull mastiff mixed. Yeah, if I just keep hitting that, uh, That sounds kind of okay. I need to get a whole playlist going. I'm working on it. It's, oh my gosh, so why does mine do. look like a pig slash goat? <laughs> it looks like a pig slash goat right now. It does? No, it doesn't. Well, because you don't have your nose shaded in. <laughs> it kind of did look like a goat. It hey, hey, Bella, stop. I'm doing something wrong. It's here. the ear look like a goat. Um, what now? I got something wrong with this ear. Mm. Here. Go get it. Yeah, the dog's eyes are dark, actually. Pretty what do you dark. mean? There's no white, like, just the glare on the eyes and maybe a little on the edge white. It's, they're mostly brown, black around the edge and then the pupil black. You know what I mean? They're dark eyes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like a goat. <laughs> you can fix it. It'll come, t it'll come together. You just got to get more done. This one, the nose is like pretty dark all the way up. Thanks, Angie. kind of like it charcoal makes a yeah, I don't know some people might th feel like it's nails on a chalkboard right depends on if that bothers you <laughs> that doesn't really bother me it doesn't give me the heaves like it does some people how about this what is your number one pet peeve if you had to pick one pet peeve what would it be and don't be a smart ass. I'm being serious. Um, wow. I guess. Uh, Thanks, Nicole. I don't know. You do. And it doesn't stuff. have to be something serious. Mine, you know what mine is? I, I don't even have to think about it. Chewed gum. People's chewed gum. It doesn't matter what they do with it. If they don't put it in the damn trash after they chew it. It makes me, I get like, I gag. So, people who save their gum for later, <laughs> um, people who, <laughs> people who put it on the side of their plate and eat and, and they expect to put it back in their mouths after, like, I don't want to see your wad of chewed gum while I'm eating. Um, people who put chewed gum on the underside of chairs and unsuspecting <laughs> victims like myself put school desks. Yeah. Anywhere. And unsuspecting victims like myself touch it. And I literally feel like I, I can't get that feeling of touching it off my hand for hours. It's the worst. <laughs> Bailey. Don't be a smart ass, you two bicker like siblings. 
I think because we're both from Michigan. We have like the smart ass. I was told by a southern gentleman that Yankees tend to be or tend to come across as smart asses. And that's not the first time I've heard that from southern folk. And I think that's because we talk fast. We we do everything faster, right? Like in the South, they're like in no hurry. They don't give a rat's ass about rushing. And we talk super fast. And that can probably come off, you know, our tone is different than what they're used to. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. But yeah, the, the gum, the the chewed gum, not necessarily even people chewing gum. It's just keep the shit in your mouth. Don't pull it out. Makes no, no one wants to see that. It's oh, and then you know what the worst part is when motherfuckers don't put it in the trash and you step in it. And oh, then yeah. And it, oh yeah, and it's summer. She's going off about gum over here. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's summertime, and that shit's melted, and on the bottom of your shoe, and it just so happens it's your brand new shoe that you just bought. That's got yeah, someone it's... else's gum, and then it's got gravel in the gum, and they're never the same. The the, <laughs> the shoes are never the same after that. They're they're just like that's when I just want to throw them out because I just I won't want to wear them again because I know there's rem- <laughs> remnants of gravel and gum on the underside of the sole. Yeah, that's a bad one. <laughs> okay, <laughs> well, whatever. I mean, that's when I say I have pet peeve. That's. I'm trying to think of what mine is. I got this messed up somehow. Um, let's see here. He's got teeth, right? Or she's got teeth. Right? Yeah, I just can't deal with the chewed gum. Mm-mm. My nose is all messed up. Is it? I got one yeah, nostril kinda. bigger than the other. Mine doesn't even have nostrils, so. Mine's got to go like. Hey, Belle, where's Bella? Bella, look at me. Look at me. Oh, you little snot. Yeah, it's like um, this is like portraits, right? It it you can't just draw the dog any way. It has to look like your dog. So um, all the little markings, like and the and the shading in their fur. This tongue you can do just like the other tongue. This is really sharp right there. Slow drivers, get your road rage going. Getting toothpaste on the wall in the mirror. Oh, how about when people brush their teeth and get the chunks of the toothpaste of the in the sink and they don't get rid of it? Yeah, it's obnoxious. This dog has like uh use it goes kinda up like this. And this kinda goes like this. Like right between the eyes. Um, kinda goes like that. 
for a second. This one has a wider snow. This kind of goes up. Makes it. Draw some teeth here, maybe. Like that. That, and when people think they can't can't turn fast, they want to stop in the middle of the road. <laughs> okay, another oh, pet peeve. Know, that's oh, what ahead. bothers me. What? Is the dang the people that when they're turning left, they'll veer to the right edge of the road and turn left, so you can't like go around them and stuff. Uh huh. You know what I'm talking about? And they don't use their turn signals, so you don't even know which way they're turning. Yeah, it's just rude. Rude. Um, <laughs> it is rude. Mine is when you're in the store and you have a shopping cart, and people just literally freaking stop dead in their tracks right in front of you and just stand there and don't get out the way. And that's when that song goes, gets in my head. Move, bitch. Get out the way. Like, come on. I'm or when they're to... looking at something in the aisle and they're standing on the other side of the aisle from what they're looking at. Yeah, okay. and their cart's on the other side and you're standing there and they <laughs> they they act like you they don't fucking see you and you know damn well they know you're there, you know? Yeah. See how the shading around his head makes him look? Because the dog's lighter than the background, right? So you have to... You have to reverse shade. You have to... You're going to have, you got your horse, your horsey drawing, and now you just, you're drawing your dogs. I know, I love it. Um, what are we going to do down here? Oh, this is really dark down here. I haven't done the rest of his face yet. I'm kind of trying. The to tongue that. is all messed up. Mine is. No, mine. Mine is. Look at mine. It's all weird looking. It's more straight. It's more. The bottom part of mine is weird. Weird. Mm. Maybe if we go like this, it's better. Mm -mm. Except for the shows going. So I'm kind of happy. I had this like kind of strange neighbor and she there moved. She did. Mm hmm. She gone. She sold her place. She gone. That's what that truck was. I just realized. I thought she, I thought she, or I forgot she was still moving shit. And right here where their whiskers come out, we haven't drawn their whiskers yet, but. Um, yeah, I don't know about the second one of mine. Oh, God, right can you guys delete Vum Ningo? <laughs> the bot Vum Ningo in chat? Vum Ningo, go away. We don't want what you're selling. Where's his face at right here? I got Who's? This, this dog. I got a. It comes down like this. I don't know. Let's go like this. Somewhere. Sorry, Angie. It's in my head to move, bitch. Get out the way. Eagle 8 is flying over or the Coast Yeah, Guard? this dog, something's wrong with its... I think the snout's just too wide right here. I think I might make him have a narrower tongue. I had to make mine wider. Really? Yeah. I think we're nailing them, though. Mm-hmm. It's a good that idea. Looks, that looks better right there. 
Oh, I'm missing his lower jaw. That's why it looked funny. Or her <laughs> lower jaw. That's what looked weird. What do you guys think? Oh, yeah, look, they look like them. <clears throat> They're getting there. That looks really good. Yours does. Yours does. No. No, yours does. Well, it doesn't look like a full-out goat anymore, but... <laughs> <laughs> Angie, you're cracking me up tonight. So, now we just got to figure out what to do with the body here. There's like a shadow going on here. So did anyone volunteer that they want to commentate sometime? So that I we didn't. can... You didn't see? I didn't see, no. Let us know. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Right. Don't let this pass you by. Act now. But wait, there's more. I was just going to say that. But wait. <laughs> there's more. Hmm. It's quiet. Mm -hmm. Very. Yeah, it's too hard to push that. I'm I mean, not complaining, I'm gonna, though. I want to make a playlist, I think. So this is hard because you got to, and there's a big shadow like right under here. And you got to kind of make the shadow, whoops, I just screwed up that. I grabbed this charcoal right here. darker and then kind of flared out like this like his hair would be and it kind of comes around here too don't it hey bobby And you take your eraser and go like this. Ugh, I don't like. I think I'm just gonna get rid of the tongue. Can I just delete the tongue? You can. Because it just does not. It actually would look cute without it on mine anyway. I don't know. I just couldn't get that right. It won't come off though. Like how about what I don't do camera because my old man is in there all the time. Oh yeah, you got oh, it. Oh, you you don't have to do camera. No. You would, you would just be like relaying chat and like just like what I'm doing, except you don't have to draw. Yeah, you could just have your little circle thing vibrate. Because I'm not really reading chat because I'm drawing too, so. Drawing. I don't think do you, you should have any commentary tomorrow for laundry. I think you should just do it. Really? Yeah. I think. Well, uh, I mean, you're you can talk about it while you do it. Just tell us what you're doing. You don't have to read what we're saying. Like, I think chat what, can just talk. I um, think that with the controversy, though, it'd be cool to like have. Um, well chat interacting with you know what I mean I guess it's so, con so, cause it's so controversial I just think it would be neat to just sit back and watch how you do it because it's pretty uh, that's like a pretty no... crazy yeah I mean I don't like, think any don't commentary even... is necessary maybe after like or when you get close to being done 
But while you're doing it, I think commentary would be a distraction. Because you're literally going to be keeping out the parts of his bones that were missing. So I think it would just be like awesome to just chill and watch. I don't know. Think about it. Yeah, oh, he makes. Oh, it's loud at your house. Aw, Foxy. Lori said her cat Foxy is watching us draw. Cats are so smart. Yeah, my cat, he uh he knows about like 30 wor words. He knows come here, go to your room. <laughs> yeah, my do my my dog. My cat um greets people like a dog. Like she was raised with the dogs. Right. So she um like, we'll come when you call her. She's not one of those cats that hides when people come over. She's very friendly. Are you watching what I'm doing? No, because I'm trying to fix my tongue here. You're fixing your tongue? Uh. Whoops, that ain't right, is it? In the leg right there. We got to do that. Different. Have you ever designed tattoos before? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's cool. Show. Do you feel like you could be a tattoo artist? Um. Yeah, except for it's really hard to get the depth. Like I have a problem with a lot of tattoo guys because um, it looks like still the seventies kind of tattoos, right? Like I like the ones that can do like the three D real looking mm. stuff, like really real looking. Yeah, I, I mean, if I you're going to get I don't think I could like achieve that. that on skin. I mean, I suppose if I got used to it. It's definitely an art. I mean, none of my tattoos are that extensive, so... This is the vine chart. I've seen some pretty damn detailed ones, though. Yeah, me too. It's pretty crazy. <sighs> I just want to stop. I'm not a fan of the portraits on people. No, but I've seen some musician portraits on people that were really good. Musicians, what do you mean? Like Jimi Hendrix or... Oh, yeah. But would you really want Jimi Hendrix on your... I mean, I guess. Some, I, mean, I guess people do. Yeah. Suppose you're right. To each his own, right? They all... Yeah. For sure. Everybody wants something. I ain't here to judge. Yeah, what, are we supposed to all have the same tattoos? All be little lemmings? All look like Kardashians? Speaking of Kardashians, have you have you guys seen the Kimye divorce saga going on? No. Oh, I followed it a little bit. Some major drama going on there. I guess sometimes it's nice to see that not you're not the only one with drama, you know. <laughs> Isn't that why we watch the shit? Isn't that why we look at that? Like, oh, God. A lot of people do. Yeah. I don't like it. I don't like drama. Oh, I don't either. I'm saying, like, keeping up with the Kardashians show. Like, I always liked that show. I have to admit, I'm not going to lie. I did, like, I haven't watched it in years. Whoops, that's too dark. All right, well, my second dog. I just can't get that. That tongue is just terrible. What am I doing wrong? Let me see it closer. Why does it look so funky? Funky Cole Medina. Because um, on, on your left, 
curve it in closer to the center and then on the right bring it like move the top of it to the your right yeah okay that's kind of what it's doing your husband has gene simmons on his arm oh my god your eight-year-old granddaughter is a kiss that's cool i love that Yeah, soap operas are funky too. All the stuff I used, going on in there. I used to watch General Hospital. Are you talking about like real soap operas on TV? Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, I used to love love watching General Hospital. I haven't watched it in so long. See now, this was the vine charcoal. You're not there yet, but just so you know, you know that mm -hmm. soft stick you have. The one yeah. that I had you lay aside. Okay, break a little half inch piece of that off, mm -hmm. and you can spread it on, and then use your finger, right? And most of it comes back off again. And then after that, take your toilet paper, your fo little folder thingy, mm -hmm. and kind of go in circular motions like this, and we're fogging the dog in on the bottom, and it kind of. Um, I don't know what the word would be. Subdues it so it's not so dark. And it kind of because you know when people do dog pictures of the face and it's just the head and it looks like it's floating in midair and it's not mm -hmm. connected? Yeah. I don't really like that. <sighs> See how I fogged it in at the bottom? Oh, my name's over it. How do I take my name off? Oh, you got your name up too. I'll leave it. Let me move it up a little bit. See how it's... Um, See how this dog's like faded in at the bottom? And like right here, mm -hmm. I got a circle going on this head that I don't like. Oh, my paper's coming apart. Yeah, I got it really dark around them. I don't know if I like that. because I started it right there. This is your second picture. I know. Isn't that impressive? They're going to be professional before you know. <laughs> yeah, right. I really got it messed up. I'm messing it up. I always get a line going that I don't like, like me shading around there, around whatever I'm doing. It's because I got to do it lighter to start with. It's getting better, I think. 
I might hit it with some really dark, and some spots. And you think it's stuck there, and then you put your toilet paper, and it kind of... Wait, what about all the people getting Steve Buscemi tattoos? What is that? I never heard of that. Me either. Okay, so... I'm out you, the loop. You're not doing it yet, but you saw me do the background, right? So you know how I did it? So mm -hmm. you can do it after. Yeah, I did. Now, will I remember? That's a whole other story. Yes, I remember. Just messing with And then you take your, you don't have this. This is a brick of charcoal here. But you can take your pencil and do it. And I just kind of, I do it a lot. I don't know if it's good or bad, but um, I really darken the edges almost kind of like All right, I think my liger, it's going to start looking like a liger if I don't stop right now. You know how you can tell, like, like this body? Yeah, and I think that so far it looks okay. Just, I don't care for the, I don't care for that one. But the one on the this side, right here, is, I like that one. You like that one? Mm-hmm. I got to put more in this one. It's too light, I think. But, um. No, this was cool. I don't have any whiskers or hair yet. Like the detail, all the hair and the whiskers. And I know. The, Send me a picture of it when here. you're done so I can copy and finish mine. Okay. Well, I'm just going to give you this one, too, then. And you can have one for your kitchen and one from your office. Oh, nice. Right? Okay, cool. <laughs> That's even Something better. Matter. And then your dog, well, if your dogs are in the office, then you can put, yeah, you can put one in the kitchen, one in the living room, and then you got your dogs in the office. So you'll have them wherever you go. Nice. Well, yeah, because I don't, this is your dogs, like, unless well, you want to. You could sell prints on your merch. Yeah. <laughs> Summer and Ballard prints <laughs> on sale today. Summer Lou. <laughs> yeah. You could, though. I could send you the original and I can tell you that how to. That would be kind of cool. I could tell you how to make the prints or just send I you think the I really made. like the one, the Summer Lou. This one. I think I did all right on that. You one. did really good. On, yeah, I got to send this. Yeah, I got the triangle. Send this the thing yeah. on the under his nose on that one. Yeah, probably makes it not look right. Pick it back up again so I can see. No, you got the tongue better. Yeah, no, so you got to do his over here. Is it looks like he's wearing a beard. You got to do <laughs> it. Looks like he's wearing a Santa beard. Look. Well, you I don't have his jaw that kind of right there, but and then the ear, yeah, I don't. Well, I figured if that was gone, it would actually look better without that stupid Santa beard hanging down. It's Jimmy not a beard. Jams, <laughs> it's not Jimmy a beard. Jimmy Jams has a Lolo mug. What's Lolo? Thanks, Bobby Gouge. Thank you, Tiffany Share. Google all the tattoos of him. 
Jay, I thought you were going to talk about the cases. Wish they'd get answers for summer. There's really nothing to talk about. I mean, there's nothing new to talk about with summer at all. Not, not today. And there's nothing going on. Don's in jail. Things are quiet. I want to go down there. I don't. It's I no longer hour. have. I no longer have any desire to go down there. When I heard that story that those people literally sat on the side of the road in Beach Creek and pretended to be broke down and some innocent bystand, like some person being nice and driving by, they freaking attacked them, robbed them, and they all they got was $30. Dude, that area, mm -mm, no thanks. I'm good. Unless I had someone from there that I was rolling around there with because that's some scary shit, man. And they don't like outsiders. No, they don't. Mm -mm. They don't want you there nosing around. So this is what I was thinking mm -hmm. where I can add to my realm of what I do because mm -hmm. I want to do it and nobody does it and I don't know why. And I probably shouldn't just say it on live, but I'm going to because people need to do it with all kind of different cases what? and it would bring more, it would make the case more personal, whatever case it is. And it would, um, people would see it from a different view mm. and that is get footage. Like I'm not in Tennessee, so I can't do it, but I want to get footage of everywhere, like really good. Mm -hmm. And then do a search where I think, you know, and get footage but see, the but thing like, is, you can't. You can't because it's private property. So you can't just go on these The road's people's... not. The road's yeah, not. But... The state land isn't. Well, the, no, but I mean, you're not. All the stores they went to, the watering hole. No, no, no. I get that. Hole, like the like, sites. Yeah. Yes, the sites. Like yeah. the different sites. And that's like what I did when I went to Denver and revisited Watts was went to the house, went to the Lazy Dog restaurant you know went to all the different sites but like with summer's case like you couldn't search because it's all private property and that's well where i want to search it isn't oh but and but like i, I think was it thinking... would be neat to see all the different places yes to see it all put together like like good I... footage yeah. yeah and like so really i was thinking put together it's been like pieces here and there of you know people going and asking questions and stuff right so i was thinking oxford's close right oh yeah mm -hmm. so i was thinking if you could give me like all the information not all the information but like the information on like um where he worked where she worked uh where their house is where the building is that they ran to in dearborn is it's um, in detroit it's downtown anything Detroit, else. yeah. Any, mm -hmm. Anything else. All Anywhere that they frequented, where he went, where they were, all that. Send that all to me. And, like, on a day, I'll just make a day out of it and go down. Or over, I should say, because it's west of me. And uh, get really good footage. Yeah, that'd be cool. And, like... But yeah. really, uh, the dad, so he didn't work. He Well, he did. He was a door dasher. Um, and the mother worked for some property management company. And she was, like, the marketing director. So they, like, rented out apartments. So there's different apartment complexes mm -hmm. that this property management um, place knew. But it'd be interesting to find out what uh, shooting range they went to as well. Yeah, that's what but I'm talking I, about. And have really good footage, not just little clips or not like from the news, like get real good lengthy footage, raw footage on it and put it together really super good. Yeah. Because no, nobody does that. Like in none of these cases, they don't do it. They, It's the news people get some or like if somebody. Some you know, of them do it. There's some boots on the ground, but it's just not. I don't feel like it's been, you know, put together like in any chronological order. It's like taken and then released. You know what I'm saying? Right. 
but yeah, even down in Tennessee, you could get a lot of really good footage. Like uh, Savannah was saying, you can't get the house because it's a pie on the road. Well, yeah, but everything else, like the surrounding it's so area, freaking out of, pretty there. You know, that's what makes me so sad that it's such a it's remote, nasty it's mountainous. Area. It's yeah. so pretty, but it's just so. There's just so much bad that goes on there, man. Like, it's just a shame. It's just a shame. But, you know, anybody that is near a case, wherever it is in the whole country, if um, as long as they look up the law, the trespassing, and know what their rights are, what they can do, and what they can't do, you know, kind of like those, you know, those audit guys. They go into like libraries and post offices and police departments mm -hmm. and do an audit to see how they, they don't, it's called an audit, but they don't say what they're doing. They're just saying they're getting footage for a story mm -hmm. and they want to see what the reaction is because you're allowed to film in, pub, in a public place. Mm -hmm. So you can go into a post office and film and people get all irate <laughs> and like the cops get called and all that kind of stuff. But the guy knows what the law is and he doesn't, he doesn't cross over the line. Right. So, it, you know, and just like property, if the road, the, the public easement um, where I'm at is 14 feet in from the road. I just feel like at this point, I mean, this is just my personal feeling, like as far as like the protesting thing went. Like for no, laundry, I wouldn't do that at all. Yeah, like the laundry thing I think was a unique circumstance. I don't think that that tactic is going to be a good tactic no. to continue using. No. Um, And as far as like with Summer's case right now, like I just feel like there's been so many people that have been there, right? There's been so many people. And there's been so many. But if you <laughs> just... don't announce you're going... If you don't no, try to knock saying, on people's think... doors, if you just go quietly, right, and you're just a nobody. Well, right, that's different. I'm just saying, yeah. like, I feel like at this point, Don's in jail, and I think that with things being quieter, that maybe it will help further the investigation with the case I without so, all of the side noise going on because – it's been side noise for eight months. And honestly, I'm enjoying that it's calmed down, that it's quiet, that I've unsubscribed from people who go live about it every day because there's nothing new. There's nothing new. There might be, oh, Benny had Candace on. Okay, big whoop. Not a reason to go live for eight hours, in my opinion. So I feel like maybe this quiet time and Don being behind bars, maybe some answers will come out. And I think that people just need to chill. I think we got a little carried away with the whole case. And lost sight of what it was all about. Some did, anyways. A lot. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not yeah. about puppies. It's not about fucking anything other than a missing five-year-old girl gives a damn who has a puppy who cares like it just i'm so over all of that nastiness i can't take it no more i can't take it no more okay so i'm gonna we planted flowers it doesn't look too too bad no, it doesn't. I'll work on it. I just, I got it. I, I only have like a short attention span. See this so right here? I don't want to mess it up. See this right here? Give that more definition right there. His, his lower jaw on each side of the tongue. When you're working on it. I got to yeah. do something with this. I got this big dark line I don't like. But yeah, kind of just um like get give define those and define this There's yeah i'm just kind of putting of, where i need to yeah just a couple and it all it's weird because like you know when i'm drawing and i add like something on the eye like the eyebrow or the eyelashes people go wow that changed everything so it only takes a little minute you know mm -hmm. don't think too deep into it kind of just like if you're looking at the picture of what we drew i didn't even look at it once 
no Mm -hmm. yeah go back and put the picture up on your screen and then like you'll see oh i got this line way over here or this needs to be darker so it shows or yeah i'm just not good with eyeing like shading but and like what i do well what i do is i took i took the color pictures that you sent me and i i lowered the contrast to z or the the saturation to zero so that it turns them black and white Mm -hmm. And then I took the contrast and I upped it to like 12. So that's where you get the shading is more defined because it's uh -huh. darker than oh, what I you really see. want to make it. So you can oh. see where it is. Yeah. So you don't actually make it that dark, but you can see it better in the picture and it's black and white. Yeah. I might actually be able to show you a picture of it here of what I did. On that. All right. Oh my gosh. It is hot in here. Who sang that? Nellie? Mm -hmm. mm. Savannah wants to know, how long have you been drawing, Scott? How long have I been drawing? My whole life, but in detail and like more uh, to do something with it for about five years. Can you see that? Oh, yeah. See how I made it black and white and darker? Yeah, it looks just like the picture that we drew. Yeah, so that's how I did it. That's what I'm looking at while I'm drawing. Cool. So I can see. <clears throat> and I only do that. I usually don't use a reference. Oh, you guys got me. Oh, my gosh, that looks so good. What does? That. Um, Bobby... I wasn't talking about them being trusted in, like, the investigation. I'm talking about TBI. Uh-oh. What about my camera work? Yeah, when I get the whiskers going, watch this. Look at that lazy here. dog. Look at her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> my neck yeah, would Lawson. hurt after Oh, I know. She doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> uh, Lawson is running unopposed. Yes. And from what I understand, his dad was also the sheriff. How do you like them apples? But Sheriff Lawson is not running this investigation. I don't believe that. TBI and FBI. And I refuse to not have... Faith in our FBI. Look at the whiskers. It's cute. That's the white thing. Yeah, that's the white pencil. And then where when it turns white out here, on the edge of the whisker, just make a little dark line. So oh, it's, nice. it, it's an optical illusion. And it looks like a shadow, but you're just... See how that did that? Yeah, it's cool. I think it's absolutely ridiculous that one... <gasps> Family can own the sheriff's office for that many years. It's like 45 years or something. I don't know. There's a channel that is new, and she went there and did the video for Summer's birthday, All Things Different on the Farm. That's the channel name? Oh, I know. She is sacked out, you guys. My neck would hurt. But I she's got like her head that. there so that she can open her eyes and look out the window if she hears anything. Just like side eye it real quick. Mm hmm. <laughs> yep. Because if I get up, like eye. if I got up and walked out of this room right now, she would jump up and follow me. I think. They usually she usually do. does. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay, here we go. We're going to do it on the other one now. Watch this. So, you take this. She's got one coming out of here. Carol. Oh, nice. Like this. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> right right here They're yeah the like whiskers this. just make it she's got it coming out like this and then she's got them that's so cute and then what you do is you take this your charcoal again your hard one or medium one and out here do a line like this i disagree and, bobby i don't think the fbi sucks at all i think they're very smart and i think that we should not underestimate 
investigations by the FBI because we were all shocked, right, about Brian's bones that were found, that they found so many. I wasn't. I knew they had most of it. Whatever. Because, you did not. Yeah, I did because they don't say what they have. They just named a couple of things and everybody's like, oh, all they got is like a tooth. And then it was, oh, they just got his jaw. Well, then you think about it. How did they come up with suicide if they only had a, a tooth or a jaw? They have to have. I don't know, but check this out. TBI has a lot going on, you guys, in that state. I feel like they have, I mean, there's a lot of busts, so they're doing their job. Where, Tennessee? Yeah. Man, there's some freaky stuff in Tennessee. Dude, there's some man. bad shit going on there that takes them years to investigate. There was two different cases I saw. I don't know if you know about them. I'd have to get their names, but two people killed their parents, killed them both, and dismembered them. One guy tried Where? to burn. He burned the damn, his dad's head in the fireplace all night. Where is this? Tennessee. He, mm. In Tennessee, man. Yeah. So, um, There's see, since you're people. not monetized. No. Um, there's a video that came out. Hang on. Oh, so like if I play something copyrighted or something, they don't shut my stream down right now? Well, it's not really, no, you won't have a problem. I just wanted to show, I'm not going to play the whole thing. I just wanted to show everybody. I'll give them the link. But check this out. I'm going to share my screen. Law. No. Who? Bailey asks if I watch Rakita Law. Oh, I've never heard of it. Can you add my thing? Oh. Your thingy. Just for a second. They only needed one um, tooth to get the DNA, but at any rate, this I'm going to put the link to this video so you guys can watch it later, but here's some of it. It's pretty interesting. Oh, before you start it? I already did. Oh, I'm not seeing nothing. All I saw is the, the mirror going in. Now you're muted. There, go ahead and let me in. Oh. So, before you start playing it, when mm -hmm. it's just on the screen. Oh, you got it different. Remember how it was before, how it kept going on and doing infinity? Yeah, because I, I clicked the wrong screen. Yeah, okay. So, listen. If you guys mm -hmm. want to make, real quick before you play this, if you Wait, guys want to think about it. If you guys... Want to make your your ceiling in a room, your bedroom or a living room, look like it's infinity with stars. Put white uh, colored or white LEDs all the way around the edge of a of a bo uh, like a two inch thick box, like wood square, and then put um, put plexiglass over the top. Put a mirror in the back and put plexiglass over the top that's got mirrored tin on it, and it'll do that same thing that your screen was doing just a minute ago. It'll look like there's no ceiling in the room. It'll like fly weird. all the way to space. And then you can put weird. And then you can put um you can put stars in it too. It's really cool. That is cool. Weird. It is sunny. It is sunny. That's my dog. Look, you've got two puppy cams in the side now. Do you guys have sound or no? No. Mm. Never mind. I don't know how to use this thing. <laughs> but here's the link, you guys. I'll put it in the chat. You guys can check out this video. It's about, um, you know, Brian's gunshot entry going in the left side of his head. Was that on Crime TV? Is that the one? Court TV. Mm -hmm. Court TV. Oh, I was watching one on Crime TV. Did a different guy come on explaining the bullet? Yes. Yes. Okay, they had a he's couple experts come on. He's wrong. <laughs> I disagree with how the bullet traveled through his head, but 
Here, because you guys you read... can watch it yourselves, and then we can discuss it tomorrow when we come on. Oh, yeah. That's a tomorrow topic. I do have one video I would like to play, though, before before I go, because I don't think anybody's seen this. I've never seen anybody talk about it, so. I'm impressed. With what? My dog drawing. I know, I didn't it's think great. They were gonna, I didn't think they were going to turn out that good at all. Like, I'm oh my surprised God, you myself. Say that. He says that every time. I'm looking at it, I'm like, man. I remember when we first looked at it, you're like, those are both the same dog. I'm like, no, they're not. I know. It's awesome. Like, I wish my tongue didn't get messed up, though. Am I trying to make you go in? Not yet. I'm looking for the video. All right. Yeah, it's fun to sit and draw. And have somebody talking to to talk to. Mm -hmm. I wish there was a way to well, make yeah, chat I mean, audible. I talk there a way to myself make... all the time. I don't know. A... That I don't know. That would be cool to make chat audible because then I could really go to town. Like, because then I could talk back while I'm drawing. I was even thinking about having like, when you're on, if I have, yeah, if you're on like this, I was thinking about having another earbud, my other ear with music playing. If like tomorrow, like say tomorrow when I'm drawn, drawn, where I can like really rip and go to town with like loud music in my ears. Wait, what do and you mean? The chat has to be nice. Hang on. When who's God dang it. Who's been mean to you? <clears throat> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not watching chat that much, but I didn't see nobody. No, she said she, when she comes back to mine, they aren't always nice to her. Oh. You must be saying something that's making them not. I don't know who's not being nice. But Snow here, Angel. if you can let me in, I want to show oh. this video. It's only like two minutes long. Snow Angel just talked about the other case in Tennessee. It's about the, he chopped his parents up in totes. Yeah. They were all over the house, and the mom's head was in the, on the stove. <laughs> That's crazy. I thought that was in Wisconsin. That trial just went on. Wasn't that in Tennessee, too? Mm -hmm. Wisconsin. Was it? Did I do okay. it? Ready? Yep. Okay. The abduction investigation out of... Okay. Now, this is from June 21st, 2021. Note the date. June, June 21st. 21st. This video only has not even 2,000 views. You ready? New details tonight in an attempted abduction investigation out of Sullivan County. At last check, the suspect, Tony Hammonds, uh, you see him on your screen, remains in jail without bond after police say he tried to kidnap a 12-year-old last Thursday. Kingsport police say the boy was mowing a lawn in the 3900 block of Skyland Drive when the 58-year-old pulled his car into the driveway, got out, and attempted to grab the child. News Channel 11's Bianca Murray spoke with police and neighbors today. She joins us live from our Kingsport Bureau. Bianca. Sarah, police say it seems to be an isolated incident. And though as far as we know, the suspect remains behind bars tonight, neighbors, especially those with kids, fear for the safety of their children. Absolutely terrifying. I mean, it's just sad that our children are no longer safe in their own home. The kidnapping attempt took place last Thursday with Kingsport police arresting the suspect on Saturday. I was outside with my little one just playing in the front yard and I saw the maroon car drive past and the guy looked at me and I saw him pulling into my neighbor's driveway and he was there a few, what I would say a few minutes, and um, I saw him drive by the other way just super, super fast. And I just thought to myself, well, he's kind of running away from something. The guy chased him into his garage, through his garage. The child got into the house, and then the subject actually tried to gain entry into the house forcibly, but was ultimately unsuccessful on doing that. Uh, the child's mother was in the house. Uh, she threatened to call the police. Of course, she did call the police, but when he heard that threat, 
uh, then he fled the area before we got there. Police say all evidence reveals that this was an isolated incident. Don't really know exactly what the individual's motives were for doing what he did, um, but, but certainly it's prudent to keep an eye on your kids. No matter the age of the child, law enforcement suggests still keeping an eye on children when they're outside. Being aware of where your kids are and keeping an eye on them uh, and, uh, and teaching them what to do, you know, teaching them not to talk to strangers, teaching them that if a stranger approaches them to come back inside. It was pretty much exactly what this boy did in this case. Police told me another individual was in the vehicle with Hammonds when he attempted to abduct the boy, but that through the course of the investigation, this man has not been charged as they believe he did not know what Hammonds was planning. Reporting live in Kingsport, I'm Bianca Murray with News Channel 11. Bianca, thanks. Now, Hammonds faces several charges, including attempted especially aggravated kidnapping, aggravated burglary, and simple assault. <laughs> what? Wow. <clears throat> June 21st. And it said that he did it the Thursday prior. So that was a report on the 21st. And if you look at the calendar, right, let's go back to the 21st of June was a Wednesday. What Which the fuck, the day, dude? That, that's the day <gasps> that's the after. the same day. No. No. That, okay. The 21st, this was reported. She said he did it the prior Thursday and was arrested. That was Thursday the 15th, the day that Summer got gone. I thought she was Tuesday. No, the 15th of June. Oh, I'm oh, looking okay. at July. My bad. You're right. I'm wrong. Fuck. I was looking at July. The 21st was a Monday. The 15th so was, was a Tuesday. You're right. And the 17th would have been Thursday. that Thursday so when he got late. caught and arrested. And yeah. this man tried to force himself in their house. And they didn't know him. Two days later. Yes. What the mm -hmm. fuck? And why is no one talking about it? And, like, why in that report do they not say... Oh, yes. And as a reminder, we still have Summer Wells missing out of Hawkins County. What? Yeah, that's how far is Kingsport from? Uh, 25 hour, minutes. Yeah. 25 minutes. In a maroon car. I mean, what is with maroon cars, trucks, whatever, in this case? <laughs> What is going on? Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, so you want to talk about weird. Here's here's video number two on the same incident, okay? This is on the same day, different report. No, she said maroon. Here, we're going to play this other one. Okay, let me, <sighs> and that name, I feel like I've heard that last name Hammond, like in people doing lives. I don't know why, it just kind of rings a bell. Okay, if you can let me in. This might be the same one, but I don't think it is. And then people down here say they need to look into this for that other teenage boy missing. And then they keep saying it's an isolated incident. Like, what? This is not isolated. This shit happens all the time there. Have you, There's... um, have you like looked at like, um, say the month surrounding the 15th mm -hmm. in like, uh, 50 mile radius of For how what? many how many kids went missing within mm -hmm. that month period within 50 miles no that, i never did but i mean look at this interesting look at this date <laughs> and look at the views like no one's watched this 
If you go to WJHL and look at the summer videos, I mean, tens of thousands of views. No one noticed this. This slipped under the radar. Yeah. This is, okay, here, let's watch this one. It might be similar. Also tonight, a Kingsport man faces charges after what investigators are calling an attempted abduction last week. The yeah, police charged 58-year-old Tony Hammonds with attempted especially aggravated kidnapping, as well as aggravated burglary and also simple assault. Investigators say a 12-year-old boy was mowing a lawn on Skyland Drive when a maroon car pulled into the driveway. The boy said Hammonds got out of the car and yelled at him and tried to grab him. News Channel 11's Bianca Murray spoke with investigators and neighbors today. She joins us live from our Kingsport newsroom tonight. Bianca, what have you learned? Well, Josh and Sarah, police tell me that this is an isolated incident. But if there's anything that cases like this teach us, it's to always watch our kids. Police say that Hammonds is charged so severely due to the age of the boy who he is accused of attempting to abduct. Now, police say somebody else was in the maroon vehicle with Hammonds when he pulled onto Skyland Drive. But they say that that person is not considered a suspect, as evidence indicates that that person did not know Hammond's intentions. One neighbor I spoke to said she saw this incident and is now worried for the safety of her own children. Absolutely. Like, my uh, kids love playing in the front yard. And after that happened, I'm just thinking, you all need to stay out of sight. If you need to play outside, we're going to be in the backyard. And after that day, I'm just thinking of every way possible to keep them safe. It's just hard because sometimes we're outside and we walk in just for the slightest minute to get something and not knowing that, you know, within a blink of an eye, something can happen to your children. Police tell me that this appears to be an isolated incident and for the Kingsport community to see a situation like this where a complete stranger attempts to abduct a child is almost unheard of and very rarely happens in Kingsport. They also advise that parents teach their kids not to talk to strangers and when a stranger tries to talk to them that they run to a parent or trusted adult like the boy in question did in this case. Now, police tell me no motive has been identified as of yet as to why the suspect would have wanted to kidnap the 12-year-old boy. But tonight, Hammonds remains in jail. Reporting live in Kingsport, Bianca Maria, News Channel 11. So my question is, is this dude still locked up? Yeah, I don't know, but what would make him pull into a driveway with somebody else in the car? <laughs> That seems odd. Mm -hmm. And the, and guy, the person oh, didn't know what he was going to do. Right, yeah, how right. would you not know what's going to happen? Right, you're just tooling around and all of a sudden he pulls in the driveway because this kid's mowing the grass? I mean, what the... Mm. Yeah, that's just... There's two teenage boys that are also missing from Kingsport. <clears throat> yeah, there's... The red truck that begun, belonged to Don Scherfe, I have no idea. Yeah, there's been several trafficking arrests, drug trafficking, human trafficking, all this stuff. And then you have Ronnie Lawson going, we don't have a drug problem in Beach Creek. Are you kidding me? Beach Creek is a drug problem. Mm -hmm. The drug problem isn't in Beach Creek. Beach Creek is the drug problem. So it's like, you what know, was he going to do with this weird because, huh. like, it's weird that there's, like, that kind of stuff going on with that kind of, like, I don't know, man. It, it must just be that area. Yeah, it's bad. You know? It's so bad. I mean, I can't imagine because, like, Kingsport, like, where that happened um, is... You know, a nice, nicer neighborhood. It's like how decent... are they doing the drugs? Like, there's no water boats, so what, are they flying because, it in? No, because they have the three state lines there, and they have the highways, and they like are bordering on actually four states: North Carolina, Kentucky. There's Tennessee, North Carolina, Kentucky, and Virginia. That all border each other like right in that vicinity but like where the property in tennessee is 
how far is what's the closest freeway to Beach Creek? Eighty one. I don't know. How, I wonder how long it takes to get there because, like, you mean from Kingsport to Ben Hill? No, from Ben Hill to a freeway. Oh, the actual freeway because the property over on Watauga Lake that takes a long time to get to a freeway because you're way up in the mountains. But if you drive down 321, my road, then you're, you make North Carolina, it's like three miles up the road. So it's right, you know, it's right in that corner. I'm more in the corner than, than, uh, Kingsport and Rogersville. I'm like closer um, to the tip, I'm just so. going to share one more time. I'm just going to scroll through because they say this is isolated. I know some of these teenagers run away. But look at if I just put WJHL missing teen in a search on YouTube. Some of these are obviously are runaways, right? But mm -hmm. I mean, this is all the same area. Like Virginia is right there. Bristol's right there. Um, witness recounts moments officers arrested kidnapping suspect found missing teen in Bristol. <laughs> Man charged after missing teen recovered in Wisconsin. Pruitt, isn't that the same name of the lead investigator on the Summer Wells case? Pruitt? Officer Pruitt? Mm-hmm. It is, isn't it? Look at 28 yep. views. 28 views. Yeah, that's <laughs> true it. Somebody said 81 went all the way to Canada. I don't think it does. I think 81 Rape? sex was 75. <gasps> oh, my God. Jay finds like new things like he, that she hasn't realized before. And I know. I'm sorry I hijacked your life, but what the fuck? That was his daughter, and he's accused of rape. Oh, God. It just makes me sick. Watch this Missing Teen Kingsport. Where's those boys that are missing? I mean, are you kidding me? Kids don't go missing. Kingsport police are searching for missing 16 year old who could be in danger two years ago. But they don't suspect foul play, but he's in, in he could be in danger. On Christmas Eve, last seen on Christmas Eve. <laughs> I can't. It's crazy. Look at this. 45 missing children recovered during largest statewide anti-human trafficking operation in Ohio. I mean, it's just, it's crazy. Yeah, it changes names, Snow Angel. I think 81 inter intersects with I-75, and then I-75 is what goes up. I-75 goes from, um, oh, here it is from here Michigan is. to Florida nine months ago. So this was May 4th. This kid was reported missing on April 27th. Hmm. I mean, they just report these like it's just. Aren't they the ones that said that they don't, uh, they don't deal with no social media either. They don't look at social media. Yes. Well, no, that was, yeah. Lawson said that. Yep. Look at this three months ago. Check this out.
A Sullivan County grand jury indicted Webb in 2018 for tampering with evidence in connection to the child death case. A record check shows Webb has a lengthy criminal history that included charges of domestic assault, driving under the influence, and possession of a handgun while under the influence. His trial date in that murder case is set for August 15th in Sullivan County Criminal Court. I mean, thanks for joining us, Aaron. This is just what goes on there. I mean, this is brand new. He hasn't even went to trial yet. I know. It was three months ago. So it's like, I, that's why I, I, I understand everyone's a suspect. This is not so going to be an easy. You get that in like Detroit or Miami or these big yeah. Chicago, but you don't expect it out in the middle of nowhere. Exactly. And that's exactly what I said to that gentleman I was talking to. I said, it's almost like the, the way you're describing it is like, it's like an inner city in the country. Yeah, and it's, it's not even the, the country. It's out in the middle of nowhere. Right. Like, people don't realize how remote that area is. No, it's and people remote. don't realize the lengths that these people will go to there. Um, I was told that they would actually um, knock trees down to have, like, you know, to go out in the mountains and do whatever, and so the cops wouldn't come out there. Like, yeah, they'll they, they'll make their own trail. No, they'll knock trees down on the road and set them on fire. Oh, so, so the you cops can't, get, can't get back there. And then they do whatever, raping women, doing whatever, and the cops can't even get to them. Mm -hmm. It's a holler. That's what they do. And it's like for them to say these are isolated incidents and we don't have a drug problem in Beach Creek. If that dude is still more concerned with his saving face on his area... I, I don't know. I, I just don't even know what Hawkins County is doing, but I can only hope the TBI is is definitely because you see them making busts every every other day. They're busting for drugs or some kind of operation going on. I mean, they're definitely, I think, busy. <laughs> and the horrible. hard part is, is finding them, right? Because it's so remote. Mm -hmm. There could be something covert, illegal activity going on for years somewhere and nobody would even notice. They don't like, even know. And then you've got all these people that are like lying and covering things up because they're all involved in illegal activities. It doesn't necessarily mean summer, but they're all like CYA because they're either selling drugs, doing drugs, they're doing something they're not supposed to be doing. And then they're being implicated in being involved in Summer's disappearance. And I just think it's ludicrous. I think that area is so bad that we have to put it in investigators' hands because there's nothing we can do. There is, there. we really are totally helpless. It's just a, it's a crazy thing. I never, never could have imagined that that area was like it is. I mean, I implore you guys, go on YouTube, go to their, go to WJHL, watch some of their older videos, go through them. Read the Times Herald or whatever the hell it's called, or the Rogersville Review. Every day, there was a woman in there. I found an article of a woman who sold, not sold her kids, she let her kids be used for pornography in order to make money. So she got paid to allow her small children to be in pornography right there in Kingsport. That's crazy. Drugs. You know, it is. It's it's so sad. Mm. I'm going to have to go on maps or earth now and look up, look at Kingsport, like how big it is and like what's around there and go on Street View and see if there's like, you know inner city if it looks inner city at all even though it's a country town you know what i mean kind of get the vibe of what that town is yeah. about mm -hmm. yep i mean i'm sure there's some like shoddy areas <clears throat> in kingsport but it's not that big but i think it's just the general area as well but there are areas in kingsport that are not like living in the holler. From what I hear, it's completely different. Like in Kingsport, they have everything 
all the stores, all the restaurants, you know, all the stuff you'd need. The holler people, like, they leave the holler, like, them for them to go to the city, it's an hour drive just to get there. Yeah, just for anything, Jake groceries or whatever. Yeah. But what's weird, though, is, like, I don't know if it's, like, right there where the wells live. But if you go, I haven't, like, mapped it, but I bet if you go a couple miles down the road, either way, three miles, five miles, whatever, you'll find a country road that goes back into another holler, whatever that holler is called, and there'll be half-million-dollar houses. Mm -hmm. Like, a lot, there's a lot of vacation homes up there that are super nice and log cabins and stuff, and, like, Ben Hill Road is, sh like, shacks, kind of. Yeah, it is. It's like so, cabins. It's kind of weird. Oh no! Another weather warning. What of what? Snow. <laughs> we got nailed up here. I heard. Yeah, we got nailed. It was bad. It was. It wasn't a lot of snow. It was the way it did it. It got warm, and then it rained. Everything melted, and then it rained, and then it turned to ice. And then we snow got snow angels. Been to the Warriors Park. I bet everybody around there goes to Warriors Park. <laughs> you got to see Summer. <laughs> Look at her oh, now. <laughs> huh. That's funny. <laughs> she's got she her runs. eye. That truck is out there running. So she's just waiting to hear something. And then, oh, look at Bella moved. She's on patrol. Sisters. It's hard to believe when I first got summer, I didn't think I didn't think it was gonna work out. Bella no. was so stressed. Cause she's really chill and low key and like she was being drugged around by her collar. It was really bad. But now they're like sisters. They don't have a choice but to get along now. I know. <laughs> <laughs> True. They had to learn to get along. <laughs> yeah. Bobby says we drive an hour to get food. We have a Dollar General now. It's 15 minutes away, but no food like Applebee's, et cetera. The one on the right is Summer, the bigger one. See, she heard someone. So yeah. <laughs> oh, what a lazy ass. <laughs> she turns over. Yeah, they got my back for sure. Your dog, the dog picture I drew is so cute. I know. I love it. You got to hang. I'm going to send it to you. You got to hang it on the wall. I will. You. I will. Or I can take a really good photograph of it and email it to you and you could just get it print, printed. Printed. I, yeah. If you want to do it that way too. Yeah. It's really cute. <laughs> Sassies. I got to get like the rest of the hair all on the top of their heads and their ears, get all the hairs going on and they'll really look good. Yeah. They turned yeah. out better than I thought. Yeah. It's cute. And their sizes are spot on too. It's so funny because summer is such a fat ass. <laughs> She's so big. Summer. Summer Lou. <laughs> Do I she... got to make her body bigger in the, in the drawing? She's such a good girl. Should I make her body bigger in the drawing? No, I think it's good. Yeah. No, I think it's one... good. Okay. <laughs> I love it. All right. I'm going to hop off here and go chill out for a while, but um, I'll see I'm you gonna... tomorrow. Yeah. I'm going to promote my tomorrow's live yeah. real quick. All right. Thanks, guys. See you later, chat. All right. Thanks, thanks Jay. Scott Skulls. All yeah, right. See you later. All right, okay. bye. Bye. All right, you guys. There's the doggies. All big. I'll throw a little bit of detail on them, the little hairs on their heads and their ears and stuff. And uh, they should look pretty good. So this is what's happening tomorrow. We're, uh, well, I'm starting a new, a new thing called Draw a Killer. It was Jay, Jay's idea. Except for I'm not going to do a portrait of them. I'm going to draw them the way I see them. Um, the way they should be depicted based on what they did or who they are as a person. So it should it should work out pretty good. So the first one is going to be tomorrow. 
Um, and yeah, I'm going to reconstruct Brian Laundrie's skull. And I don't know how close I'll be to the actual factual anthropologists um, recreation or creation, but I'm going to do it from the autopsy report, what people, the news people have said. And uh, we'll see how it turns out. It should be pretty wicked looking, I would think. So that's going to be tomorrow at 7. And I do believe Jay is going to come on and talk. And I know it's real controversial. The whole case is um, a lot of people have a lot of different views and a lot of different opinions. Um, even I have a strong feeling on what I believed happened, but I don't think we'll ever know. And I don't think it's over. I think there's more going to come out and it's going to, just keep spinning and spinning, right? It's been, every time something comes out, there's been a new twist to it. It changes everything. So uh, I think it's going to continue. So anyways, you guys, uh, yeah, I had fun tonight. We got to draw doggies. And uh, tomorrow should be interesting. All right. Thanks for being here, you guys. See you next time. Scotty Skulls is out. Later.